Ghostbusters Frozen Empire is here. The original cast is back together to save the world right here in New York City where it all began. And of course, bring us all the necessary nostalgia. To be here on a night like this and the weather's like this and the fans are like this and the movie's about to show, there's nothing better in life. What is it like being back in New York in the old firehouse? It's exciting, uh, and I'm very grateful for my collaborators. You know, we don't do this alone. Um, but again, people like to laugh, they love to be scared, and they, they love good quality, uh, honest entertainment. I think that's what we have here. We got they an love you movie. guys. They love you they, guys. Well, we, the camaraderie in the cast is really strong. Official Proton Pack carrying member of the Ghostbusters now. What's that feeling like, being in the, one of the most iconic buildings in film history? It's so many things. To be able to do, just to put on that suit and that, but it's, it, that's part of it. But the bigger part is that I do that and I'm holding the thing and I look there and Bill Murray's in the exact same flight suit with the pack and Dan Aykroyd and then Ernie is right there and Annie Potts right there. We're all, you know, with the proton packs on and it's, uh, it's just, it's like, what? I this feel like that's no a sense at all. Like imposter syndrome at its highest. Well, it's a it's a weird experience to know something so well your whole life and to be a fan of it and a fan certainly of the people involved. You know, I was I, I didn't grow up in this business. I had no one in my family did this. I just watched these movies like everybody else as a fan and and so I never really could have foreseen this happening. Do you feel redemption for Winston in this new rendition where he's a billionaire owner of the franchise? There is no redemption. There is no. I, I, <laughs> you know, uh, Winston came in looking for a steady paycheck and um, and it started out the way it did and the fans are all very aware of that. But I, I can give credit to Sony and the filmmakers Jason Reitman and Ivan for allowing the character to develop and grow. Now Winston has done very well. He's a billionaire. He owns the franchise and he very much has a, 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 a part to play, not just to be in the movie. And I'm so thankful for that. Bill, will you keep being a part of these movies as long as they make them? Uh, as long as they're good. I'm sorry. I'm Who's sorry? Dan dresses that thing? <laughs> I don't know. That I'm thing's sorry. crazy. Do you feel like you're one of the gang now? It, it's weird to think that I'm a Ghostbuster. I'm still not used to it. I feel like uh, whenever I'm doing interviews with them or on shows with the OGs, I'm like, am I allowed to be speaking on behalf of the Ghostbusters. But it's really cool to be two movies in now and to be doing this. It's so special. Can you see yourself doing this in 40, 50 years? Oh, man. Will any of, well, with AI, will any of us be doing this in 40 or 50 years?